I think there's this kind of myth that's perpetrated often, which is this myth of consistency, uh, that it's really important to be consistent. And as I think you hear this a lot, like if you go to art school or something and you talk to your professors and they tell you the one thing you should do is like find one thing and that no one else is doing and then do that thing incessantly, 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 um, and kind of commit to it. But I think that uh, there is wisdom in that, but I think also that you know life is a journey and uh, you have new information coming in all the time and you often have to like make radical changes in course and direction and I think it's really important to be sensitive and intuitive to the things happening around you so you can pick up on those cues and change course when you need to. So I'm going to talk about a few kind of different phases that, I, that I've gone through creatively, um, starting with my teenage years up until today. And, and each of these phases um, sort of comes with a with a kind of promise um, that it starts with. When I, I first enter into it, I think like, oh, this is gonna be the thing that, that really does it. This is gonna be the thing that answers all my problems, all my questions. And then inevitably, I realize that that, that promise comes with a cost, and that each of these um, phases also has a downside or a weakness. And, uh, and so it's kind of been this process of, of vacillating between idealism and um, getting those hopes um, shot a little bit.